beamish as we remain the envy of the nation when it comes to weather. Yes, among many other things. I think Mexican food, you can probably put that on the list. Yeah, too, I right? think. Uh, but this morning, uh, yeah. there's people that are really, really cold back east. Uh, yes, and we will talk about that coming up at 6.15, Mr. Mooney. For now, though, we head outside. This our News 4 Tucson Skynet cam on the northwest side river in La Choya. Certainly hope you had a great holiday. If you're heading back to work, here's your commute cast. Upper 40s for the morning rush. Mid-70s, the drive home. And speaking of that drive home, yours truly. Hopping on the radio side, 4 to 5 p.m. on AM 1030 KVOI The Voice with host Mike Shaw. My monthly weather chat. Certainly hope you'll tune in. Low to mid 70s across Metro Tucson this afternoon. Daytime highs despite the cloud cover running about 10 to 12 degrees above average for this time of year. Followed up with nighttime lows in the 40s for much of southern Arizona. Still dropping below the freezing mark over portions of the Sulphur Springs Valley late tonight. But this cloud cover will hang tough through the afternoon and overnight hours. Being supplied by an area of low pressure spinning off the Southern California Baja coast. Notice the arc of clouds from Los Angeles to Vegas and right here in Tucson. That's being steered in by a ridge that's parked over the Baja Peninsula and that dome of high pressure is the reason why temperatures are running well above average for early January standards. Still dealing with some air quality issues, not in Tucson, but down in Santa Cruz County where an air quality warning will continue through the afternoon and nighttime hours. This is due to elevated levels of particulate matter. Here are some ways you can reduce adding of that particulate matter into the atmosphere. Combine all of your errands into one trip. Avoid burning leaves, trash, other materials down in Santa Cruz County, as well as avoiding using fireplaces and wood stoves. We need some type of frontal boundary to try to clear out the low levels of the atmosphere down in Santa Cruz County. We just don't really have one over the next seven days. In fact, temperatures start to increase into the upper 70s for your Thursday and Friday. Friday afternoon, near record heat in the forecast for Tucson. Clouds return Saturday and Sunday and computer models differing right now on what's going to happen this weekend. GFS model has a slight chance of showers in Saturday night into early Sunday morning. European models high and dry right now. Partly cloudy skies rain free the call. Temperatures dropping as well back to the low to mid 70s still well above early January standards.